This is a very special show that we've been doing for um, about four years now in honor and memory of my son, Lucas Alvarez. Uh, as you can see, this is his truck here. He was unfortunately involved in a boating accident in the Florida Keys. I mean, all kids are special, but he was special and very, very different. Um, he was a very simple-minded guy. Um, since he was a very uh, young kid, he wanted an old classic truck like this. You can see his, um, his dirt bike in the back. My son was such an incredible mechanic. He would work on his motorbike, he'd work on his, on his, on his truck, on his outboard engines uh, remarkably well. So he had this incredible God-given gift and passion for mechanics. And so my wife and I, after the accident, we immediately both decided we're going to start a, um, a foundation, which is now called the Lucas Alvarez LA6 Foundation. And what we do is we send kids uh, mostly uh, from the inner city that have a passion to become an automotive technician, uh, to go into HVAC, plumbing, electrical, whatever they want. If the passion is there, we got them. And what I love about the classic cars in general is not so much the cars, it's really the fellowship, the group, the people that it fosters, that it creates in these car shows like this one today. It's really, that's where the magic happens. And Lucas would come with me to these shows as a very, very young boy. And he just said, Dad, everybody's so nice. He, you know, he, he liked the cars too, but he would always, that's what he was, would take from it, how special it is. And yes, cars might be the vehicle, no pun intended, that, that, that brings people together. But at the end of the day, I do believe that people are yearning for, for, for something greater. And they find it in gatherings like this. Thank you once again for coming to, uh, to the Lucas Alvarez LA6 Car Show. Our organization is all about heart. It's all about helping the little guy. I always told my, both of my boys, I remember the little guy. And at first they thought, what do you mean, Dad, a little guy? I go, no, 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 the little guy. Maybe the one that's being bullied, the one that the, the, the crayons fell on the floor and everybody's laughing at him. Whatever it is, whatever it is, remember the little guy. And they never, ever forgot that. And we're just, you know, so blessed to have had him here for 18 years. But we do believe as faithful people that the best is yet to come.